Imagine it's that time of year again. Performance evaluation. You're walking to meet your manager and you realize your palms are sweaty. Your heart's racing. You're nervous. But you try and put those nerves in check. Even though you know you have anxiety because your family is depending on the promotion this year. But you remind yourself, Look, I did everything I could have possibly done to get this promotion. Maybe your manager was right the past two times. You weren't quite ready. But as you're approaching that room, you're like, this time I got this. There's no excuse. I mean, your manager is a fair person, right? They see your contributions. And maybe you don't quite have the same background as your manager and your peers on the, on the team, but that doesn't matter. You're the best performer. And maybe you don't quite look and act like everyone else on the team, but that shouldn't matter either. Your work speaks for itself. As you're approaching the door, you try and calm those thoughts. The last thing you tell yourself is like, look, I'm sure the company understands the value I bring to the table and they value me as an employee. Don't they? Is the last thought you have in your mind as you reach for that door and you open it. You walk in and you see your manager. They're very excited. They have a huge smile on their face, energized greeting. You're like, okay, whew, this is it. I got worked out for nothing. You walk in, you take a seat and you let yourself relax. But in an instant, the mood changes. Your manager looks at you and says, look, I know you're hoping for a promotion. But, while this scenario might sound like fiction, it's in fact a lived reality. Every single day, corporate security professionals are marginalized and left out of senior leadership positions. Internal policies and archaic traditions have led to a group of historically marginalized groups being left out of the most valued positions in an, an organization. My dissertation will focus on identifying the systemic barriers that stand in the way of these marginalized groups attaining senior leadership positions. I will explore facilitators that have helped advance those that are marginalized attain the senior most ranks. And lastly, I will discover scalable solutions that can be applied across the industry to change the future of marginalized groups. Thank you.